Good morning, guys. Welcome to Sunday. Just got wrapped up with Bryce's basketball. You'll see that in another video. But now we're gonna just start a vlog because it's Sunday and, uh, you know, we do stuff on Sundays. First order of business? Brunch. Brunch. We're, uh, because we're in Central Phoenix on Central Avenue, uh, there's lots of cool places to eat around here that we've never been to, and, you know, some we've heard of, some we've never heard of. This is uh, Ellie's Breakfast and Cafe. So. Brunch and cafe, something First like that. First place that showed up. First place that showed up, and uh, there's a line out the door, which means you know it's good. Oh. This is what you get when you live downtown. Oh. Yep. You don't get this in the suburbs. In the rural, we have cow pastures. Yeah. We have cow pastures. They've got cute little uh, breakfast places. All right, breakfast is served. I got the Latina omelet. It's got some black beans, avocado, Mexican cheese. Oh yeah, jalapenos. Bryce went with a Southwest omelet. Look at that, two Mexican inspired dishes. What's up with that? It's an omelet, but it's a breakfast but, omelet. Bre breakfast omelet, breakfast omelet. No, no, no. Of course, Sierra got her sweet tooth fixed. Some chocolate chip pancakes, looking amazing. And of course, Tiffany also has a Mexican inspired, my favorite, chile quiles. So I'll be sharing that with her. Check out this, guys. This is a, this is a Diablo uh, Bloody Mary. It's got ghost pepper. Infusion. Yeah, that's why it's so hot. It's hot. It's hot. Look what just happened. We totally rotated plates. Everyone's plates went one to the right. Bryce is finishing my omelet. I'm finishing Tiffany's chili Achilles. Sierra's eating her his hash browns. And you're eating toast. Wrapped up with breakfast, which was amazing. amazing. Too bad it's not close to home. We probably won't ever be back. But it was really good food. Um, but now we have a special treat. Well, I don't know, really a special treat, but we're really excited about this because my mom bought a house. She bought a mobile home in a mobile home park. Um, you know, she's a little older, so it's age restricted, is that what it's called? Yeah, like, like 50. It's a gated community, 55 plus, which is great for her. And she bought, bought with her like own money, a mobile home. Like it she owns it, like crazy, like came out of nowhere, left field, was like, guess what guys? This is my new place. We're like, no, what? Place. Yeah, so uh, we're here, we're gonna help her paint uh, a wall and the, the ceiling uh, before she actually gets to move in, which then I'm sure next week or next weekend, we'll probably be back over here to help her move because I got the truck, you know, so convenient. So just a preface, uh, she just bought this like, four or five days ago and the previous owner was a carpenter and so he was doing a lot of work to it and obviously at some point he decided he no longer wanted to own it but he was still doing work on it so some things are done some things aren't done some things are kind of like in the middle but he promised he'd finish it for her um, so there's a lot of construction going on here so keep that in mind all right so now bryce is going to give us a quick tour of the of the of the, of the house here uh, this is kind of like the the garage entry so my mom would park here in the carport this is where the washer and dryer will go eventually She's gonna have uh, some doors built here for this to be like her kitchen pantry. So this is where all like the canned goods and stuff like that. The ramen, the spicy ramen. Right, Bryce? Yeah. All right. So straight ahead we got a bathroom. Uh, so like, it's gonna be like the guest bathroom. The guest bathroom. Right? This is, this is the guest bedroom. All right. Closet. Bay window, very nice. Room for a bed. So the, okay. if the kids wanna come stay the night with grandma, they can do that. We should stay the night in the house. Yeah, yeah. yeah. House. Closet, okay, all right. And then you walk in. Kitchen and a dining room. So she has an actual dining room where she has a table and chairs. New uh, new appliances. Those are brand new, which is nice, right? Fridge and freezer. Yeah. Front door's there with a doggy door. Grandma can get a dog. She has a doggy door. Living room, right? And so we're going to be painting that wall and the ceiling. Make it all white, bright white. I think the TV's going to go on that wall because that's where the cable outlet is. But yeah. you're right, she could probably put it on that wall too. Where the couch it, that's the thing, it depends on where the couch goes. So we'll see. Okay. Yeah, we'll see. All right, so this is the master bedroom. We got uh, Arcadia door, closets, two closets. Bathroom still being worked on. The tile's all new though. That's all new. I think that's new, that looks new. Lots of newness. Oh yeah, there's more tile. <laughs> How excited are you? I'm super excited. I'm this stoked. This is so awesome. <laughs> yes. This is so cool. So there you go. Uh, 1,200 square feet. Perfect size for her. And like I said, room to grow. Room for, uh, uh, like I said, grandkids want to come stay the night. They got extra room for them. Plenty of room to run around. She's got a, a big lot. So lots of uh, space around. Backyard, side yard, that sort of thing. And uh, like I said, it's already pre-made for a doggy. So she can get a doggy. And it's all mine. I know. I know. <laughs> so excited.
excited about that. So excited about that. All right, let's get to painting. Should, should we put like tape around that thing? Or uh, I'll uh, probably take it off. All right, get the one clip out. Is like when you begin, then once you keep. I said I was never gonna paint again. <laughs> Actually, her exact words were, "You're not gonna help your mom paint her house before you help me paint my house." That was her exact ah, words. Green walls. <laughs> Yeah, she hates the green walls. In the guest room? Well, I don't blame her. Green's not my favorite color either. What are you doing? I'm um, putting in these... Liners? Liners, yeah. There you go. Sierra took over. Is it fun? Mm-hmm. Um, I don't know. I did. <laughs> yeah? No, I'll grab a brush and we'll start going. Here, I'll, I'll use that. Yeah, cool. Yeah, absolutely. Here, what I'll do is this, right? The handprint. The Victoria's handprint right there. Way to go, bro. Yeah. Now we got your fingerprints in the system. Well, there's Clint and Grandpa. They're working on the wall. It's getting good. They did a good job. You got such a big business. And the youngest one, Travis, is working on a little bit of space right there. Coming along, looking good. And of course, we have these guys. They're hard at work helping, too. <laughs> Taking a break. <laughs> Well, there you go, guys. That's my mom's new house. Uh, like I said, baby steps. There's some construction that still have to happen. Uh, we finished the painting, and uh, there'll, be, there'll be many more opportunities to see the house. And obviously, we're gonna help her move uh, probably next weekend. Um, so yeah, we're excited for her. She's super excited about it, and uh, more about that in the future. I just dropped off Bryce at a friend's house. He's gonna be over there for a couple of hours to play with them. Probably do some Fortnite or something. I don't know. You know, boys being boys. The girls are gonna play some cards and uh, have some some girly time. I'm gonna go upstairs and stream for a couple hours, and then, and then we're gonna go see Avengers: Infinity War. Sierra's a little upset. She says she saw a spoiler or thought she saw a spoiler. Oh, I, I did a spoiler. It was I a spoiler. Twice okay. Now. Anyways, we're gonna go see the movie tonight, so no spoilers. Because I'm like some of you guys were. I don't know if some of them were trolling or some were really. I don't know. I'm. Tiffany said she saw some things in the comments from yesterday's vlog, and I was like, Ugh. So, we need to go see the movie so we don't get spoiled. That's what we're gonna do tonight. All right, guys, we picked up Bryce from his friend's house, and we're now here at the movies on our way to go in and see Infinity War. We're so excited, so excited. We've been talking about like all the different Infinity Stones, when we saw them, um, you know, some rumors we've heard, kind of like getting, getting the hype going. Uh, so we're gonna go in, we're gonna grab a soda, grab our seats, and I will see you guys after the movie. All right, we're back home after the movie. What'd you guys think? It was awesome. Awesome, awesome. Definitely two thumbs up, definitely worth seeing. Probably worth seeing twice. I feel like we need to go see it again just in case we missed some stuff. Yeah, and we were in the very front seat. Yeah, we got the worst seats in the theater, My literally the first front. row. We had to like look up to it was, see everything. Was, I've, never been, I've never been in the front row. I have been once. It was horrible, I would never do it again, but we really wanted to see the movie, so it was worth it. Um, we have to wait a whole year for part two, though. Like, I'm so bummed That's about that. Right, yeah. Like, so, so many movies, so many movies that did like the two parters. They, they didn't wait a whole year. I don't think was Harry Potter was the last Harry Potter a year apart. I, I feel like it was like well, that means, you know, six gonna, months. You know, it's gonna be good then. Well, it yeah. takes a whole year to yeah. finish recording. And so we got a whole year. I don't know. We we'll do some research. I know uh, there's. I don't want. I don't want any spoilers, but. Um, Man, good movie, good movie. Worth worth the 10 years of build up. It took him 10 years. The first Iron Man movie was 10 years ago. So, 10 oh. years in the making. Anyways guys, uh, it's late. Kids gotta go to bed, they got school tomorrow. Thanks so much for watching. Thumbs up if you liked it. I am the Sky for more videos. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Vlog on.